Linda, I promise I will always be your partner in life, whether you need someone to help you get through tough times, someone to support you as you work towards your goals, or just someone to brush your teeth with. I promise to do the stuff that neither of us wants to do if you really don't want to do it more than I don't want to do it. I promise to continue telling you all of my fishing stories. And when I finally run out of stories to tell, I'll just start retelling the old ones. <laughs> I promise to give you and our family my all. I will always be there for you, Kayla and Kaysen, through the good times and the bad times. I will be around to help celebrate good grades, to attend school musicals, and to play Scrabble. I will also be by your side to break up arguments, to deal with hangry kids, <laughs> and to figure out what to do when one child rips his wedding tie three days before the wedding. <laughs> Linda, I choose you to be no one other than yourself, loving what I know of you and trusting what things I will discover. I will respect you as a person, a partner, and an equal. Daniel, you are the joy in my heart, the constant laughter in my voice, and the smile on my face. We often hear that we complement each other so beautifully, and I know together we can face anything. You are the love of my life, my best friend, as Kayla and Kaysen would say, my soulmate. In good times and bad, may we always laugh together like we do now, especially after I gave you excellent directions to the Starbucks roasting plant and not the coffee store. <laughs> I promise to celebrate with you, to encourage you, to always believe in you, and to always be proud of the man you are, like when it took you two hours to learn how to use chopsticks at the Sushi Alive <laughs> restaurant. <laughs> I promise that from this day forward, I will always love, honor, and respect you. I will always stand by your side and forever create everlasting memories with you and the kids, like today on our wedding day at Rose, Rose Hill Mansion. <laughs> so beautiful. December 12, 2015, Dan visited Linda's parents for, the, for dinner. He brought a cobia that Linda's mother steamed in lemongrass and ginger and served. This was the day that Kayla and Kaysen were first introduced to Dan. Kaysen greeted Dan at the front door and said, Oi. <laughs> I thought that was an inside joke. <laughs> it was not. Kayla also greeted Dan, <clears throat> but was too shy to talk to him for the rest of the day. Kayla and Kaysen, the last two years with you and your mom have been a blast. Can we remember when I was known as mom's friend, then it was Mr. Dan, and now two years later it's Da Dan all your nicknames that you gave to me. My relationship with the two of you is very near and dear to my heart. I have worked my hardest to earn your trust and to build special bonds with both of you. On this day, I want to make the two of you the following promises. <clears throat> promise to always be fair and honest with you. I promise to show you how a man should treat a woman through my relationship with your mom. I will not attempt to replace anyone, but will make a special place in your hearts that is for me alone. I will be father and friend, and I will cherish my life with both of you. On this day when I marry your mom, I marry you, and I promise to love and support you as my own. I would also like to make three promises to each of you individually. Kayla, I promise to always be your baking partner, and double check your measurements, especially when we make brownies. <laughs> promise to always wake you up with pokes. And I promise to always have a hard scarf ready for you. Kaysen, I promise to continue the tradition of Rose Night Out. We will play video games, watch food, build Legos, and eat great food. I promise to always find time for Nerf battles and target shootouts. And I promise to always help with homework even when you don't tell me about it, 
until bedtime the night before. With this ring. With this ring. I thee wed. I be wed. With this ring. I thee wed. I thee wed. <laughs> For as much as Dan and Linda have consented together into holy wedlock and have witnessed the same before God and this company and have declared the same by giving and receiving a ring, I now pronounce you are husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. There is little to say to you that I have not that you have not already heard, and little to give that is not already freely given. As I have given you my hand to hold, so I give you my life to keep. You are where my heart is and the reason that I believe in love. I promise to always give all that I have and all that I am. For all the days of my life, this is my solemn vow to you.